I'm going to use a quarter inch Amstel rigging line as my redirect. I like it, it's slippery and it's 7400 pound rated quarter inch. What I'm going to do rather than using carabiners is to uh, tie a triple bowline loop. Two of the loops I'll use for the redirect to capture the climbing line. The third loop, uh, because of the bulkiness of the knot, I'm tying that off with a figure eight stopper knot. I can make these as long as I want, and uh, hopefully they'll pull back fairly easily. Here's where I can pull the uh, climbing line back through the um, redirects and pull back the redirect and recover it from the ground or the tree in which I'm traversing to. Here's an example of trying a redirect. I'm not going to put the stopper knot on here and when I get a little better at tying these I'd like to tie them uh, very small. The, the uh, double loops should be as small as possible and the third, the stopper knot, the figure eight stopper knot should be as small as possible ev also s so that it's a little easier to pull back through the crotch when the time comes or to pull back through the tree structure. Okay, I've set this up just horizontally representing what could be done in the tree both vertically and horizontally and I've tied the uh, triple bolands uh, replacing the carabiners. Again, I didn't put the stopper knot on these. But the idea is that those would be life support and I can pull the climbing line back through those just like I would a carabiner. And then I can recover the uh, redirect line. Now I have 200 feet of this line, which is an extreme amount of line. Probably take it down to uh, 100 feet, depending on depending on what I needed at the time. Now I did do the redirect earlier with the carabiner and just tying it off with the bowline, but uh, this is looking like I can pull those through, pull the climbing line through all of the uh, bolands, and then uh, pull the uh, redirects through the canopy. One concern I would have is getting those bolands caught on something, but it's a strong climbing line, that's a strong, strong line, so you could give it a pretty good tug, and if those bolands are tied pretty tight and the stopper knot is tied pretty not tight as well I think I can get those to recover pretty well. So 200 feet in this bag right here so even if I took it to half of that it'd be quite a bit of line for redirects in a very small space.